What's Bruce Lee's favorite drink? What? I couldn't hold it together. This is my life. I'm sorry. This is... This is me. Now. There's this condition called heterochromia, which is basically when someone's eyes are different colors. There's also sectoral heterochromia, where a single iris has two different colors in it. And then there's central heterochromia, where the center of a person's eye is a different color than the outside. This is pretty cool, so do wet or comment if you have it. Maybe if we wait just a little bit longer, a fuck will fall into my hand, and I can give it to you. Well, I see you have a beard, a sturdy frame, and tattoos. <laughs> Excuse me while I take off my clothes. Yeah! You guys hear that? This is the song that made me famous on TikTok. You're not yeah. famous. What? You're not famous. Stop. A thousand followers isn't famous. Did you pick up? Hello. Hey, bro. How's it going? Hey, who's this? Hey, it's uh, Ryan from the gym. Yo. Hey, bro. How's it going? What are you up to tonight? Yeah, Tillman, uh, I usually do the 11 o'clock workouts with you. Oh, sweet, yeah. Hey, man, oh, what are you doing tonight? Not much, I'm just in my apartment. Oh, cool. Um, hey, I had a question for you. Okay. Um, I saw you come to the gym with this uh, pretty cute redhead girl, and uh, I was just wondering if you knew if she was single or not. Uh, no, she's not. Oh, damn, man, that sucks. Yeah, no, that's, that's my girlfriend. Oh, man, you fucking scored. <laughs> yeah, thanks, buddy. PSA, guys. Are you ready for this? Women, quit acting like you're so special. Can we stop saying the term, all men are dirtbags, all men are cheaters? Dun, 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 dun. Well, if that's the case, all women are scum, all women are hoes. What? Did that make you feel sick? And like, oh, this lady's blah, blah, blah. I don't care. Here's the thing. There's just as many women out there who are narcissistic, emotionally abusive hoes, sleeping around, hustling men left and right, and then taking a perfectly good man that's just, mm, he's everything that you could ever possibly want, putting him through the ringer and throwing him back out into the wild. And then he ends up with a woman who's been through the ringer. And then she's got all these barriers up and she sees this guy and she's like, oh, he's playing games. Oh, he's no emotional. Well, guess what, bitch? The last guy you were with, you did that same thing too because you were being careful. So have patience because there are crazy women out there doing bad things to good men. Okay, so some of you guys might call me a genius for this or some of you guys might call me a bad mom. I don't know which one it's going to be, but we're going to figure it out. I have a son who I love and adore more than anything in the world, and he's seven. But this boy is a little crybaby. I mean, he's the kind of kid that cries about the dumbest shit. Like if he's eating a taco and the shell cracks. I mean, it's like full on tears, like a meltdown. Now I want him to be sensitive and emotional and be able to cry about stuff that matters. So I may have told him a little fib. Basically what I said to him was, is that he only has a certain amount of tears. And that if he cries about stupid stuff, he's gonna waste all of his tears. And that one day he'll wanna use those tears on something that makes him really, really happy or really, really sad. And he's gonna go to use them and he's not gonna have any left because he cried about dumb shit. When I tell you we were at the park and the kid fell off the swing and normally he would have a full on freaking meltdown, he looked at me in my face and he just sucked it up and walked away. And it was one of my proudest parenting moments. So if you have a kid at home that likes to cry about dumb shit too, try this out and let me know if it works. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Grandma, Grandma, I crashed your car. You what? I crashed your car. What? Come on! <laughs> I crashed your car. <laughs> what is this? 
I'm just kidding. I bought you a car. <laughs> I bought you a car. Bought me a car. It's the one you've always wanted. <laughs> sorry, my son drives a motorcycle. I'm so sorry. It's okay. okay. I really am. I, I, it's okay. okay. Hey, hey, accidents happen. Yeah, okay. But they would have killed you. I, it's okay. Hey, I'm so hey, sorry. I'm not mad. Okay. I understand you just didn't see me. No, I didn't. Okay. It's I it's. Didn't. It's okay. All right. Yeah. Things happen. I deal with people like that every day. Yeah. It's you just didn't see me. I really didn't see. You, you said you're sorry, and we're good from now. Okay. Yes. You said. And my son really does travel motorcycle. Okay. So I would have never done that. I'm so no, sorry. No, it's it's all okay. All right. It, it scared me at first, and me then too. you were me saying too. sorry, and I I accept your apology. Okay. I really am. Sorry. Okay. I just can you do one thing for me? What? Can you just look out for us just a little bit I better? Will. Will. Okay. I really do. I if I don't know what I would have done if I would have hit you. It's okay. I'm really it's sorry. It's okay. All right. Yeah. That, that's why I got the helmet and everything. Right? I still would have got your 